The job of the subconscious mind is to keep you where you are now. That's its job. The subconscious mind wants what it's got and it does not want what it's not got. It wants what it's got and it doesn't want what it's not got. So in other words, every habit that we've got, the subconscious mind wants it, be it good or bad, right? doesn't matter what it is. The subconscious mind wants it because it's got it, right? It wants it. In other words, it wants to keep you in your comfort zone. That habit, even if it's a negative habit, is in your comfort zone, so it wants it. So, one thing I can tell you is that the subconscious mind never, ever wants the new goal. Never. Only the conscious mind. So, that's what we've got to do is get the goal into the subconscious mind. That's what we've got to do. And we can. I'll give you a demonstration as well in a moment that will show that. Now, you know, this subconscious mind... It is so powerful. And how does it keep you where you are now? With that. Huh? What do you think that is? Self-talk. Chatter. Who put it there? We did. Or we allowed it there. So have you ever had an experience like this? Oh, I'm no good at this stuff. There's no way in the world. I can't get this. Oh, just kidding. You know, I'm... I haven't practiced, I'm not going to get there. Golly, this is no good. I I don't deserve it anyway, I'm no good at this. You ever had that little voice come in? That little voice, 65,000 times a day, away it goes, right? And it brings it up. And that's a sabotaging little voice that keeps us where we are now. But what we can do is change that voice. We can make it into a voice like this. Ah, yes, I'm good at this. Boy, I've been practicing this. How long have I been practicing? A while now. I'm getting better and better. I deserve to win this. I'm going to get this. I'm getting better and better and better at this. Yes, I'm there. That kind of voice we can develop. We can put that into the subconscious mind and we can work in alpha or theta to do it. That's what we can do. You know, I'm just going to give that little demonstration that I spoke about before. If you want a goal in your life, right, you are going in this direction with the conscious mind, you want this goal. And so away you go, you've got 12% of the mind working away, going down this road, right? But which part of the mind doesn't want it? The subconscious mind, until it's got it. The subconscious mind doesn't want it. So you've got 88% of your mind pulling you back and sabotaging you and pulling you back and sabotaging you, haven't you? Which one's going to win? The 88% is going to win. The subconscious mind is going to win. What we can do is get that 88% on track. That's what we want to do. So that we've got 100%. 88 and 12, going in this direction, going to where we want to go. Then we will get our goals faster. That's what's going to happen. That's what we can do. And that's why we can achieve faster using the subconscious mind deliberately.